The rec center at Joe Brown Park in New Orleans East was busy Monday, but not with the usual activity. It's here where FEMA has one of dozens of teams helping survivors of Hurricane Ida navigate the recovery process. There are a lot of facilities where people have been able to go to apply with FEMA for assistance. And while people can still head to sites in the disaster area to file with FEMA or get one-on-one -on -one answers, agency officials say the fastest and easiest way to get help is online. A lot of the cell phone providers were able to get a lot of areas restored really quickly. According to the FCC, just 1.8% of cell sites in the disaster area remain out of service. John Mills with FEMA says filing online through a cell phone, if possible, is preferred. The website, disasterassistance.gov. But with power still limited in many areas, that can be a tall order. So sites like the one at Joe Brown are open for those who need face-to-face -face help. We have crews at more than 25 locations, and we're working right now to continue to provide uh, expanded services to help survivors one-on-one -on -one go through the application process. Often the first step on the long road to recovery. Danny Monteverdi, Eyewitness News. All right, FEMA says you should keep in touch with them and update your applications so that they can learn about your needs if something changes.